Anchorage is really a sanctuary for people. It's been this way for almost 60 years now. It was very important uh, to me as a child. It gave me a great place to come and find sanctuary and develop a community of friends, and that's still what we focus on. It really just makes disciples, they learn about God, they learn more about themselves. They're in a safe place where they can be themselves and ask questions where they may not have been able to do that before. get to do things like this, to be present with students as they walk through some of the most important years of their life. So at Lutheran Campus Ministry here at the University of Maryland and the several other campuses where we have ministries, we're doing something here that we couldn't do alone. We couldn't do without being together, with being church together. I realized that these people were children of God and they were part of my congregation. Today, throughout the country, there are 30 such congregational-based ministries in prisons. That was the idea from the very beginning, that would be a word and sacrament ministry, and it was its first of its kind anywhere in the United States. It really creates a community for me. It allows me to meet other people who have the same passion and interest as me not only learn more about other people and grow in my relationships, but just to learn more about myself. Being involved with the programs that Youth and Young Adult Ministry has had has allowed me to really draw closer to God and closer to peers that have helped me in my own relationship with God. It's amazing for me to, to walk with people throughout their faith journey, whether it's they're just coming to meet Jesus for the first time or whether they've uh, been a lifelong Lutheran uh, part of the church. I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. <laughs>